Basically, he was kind of asking about, you know, the, with the state of the, the upcoming election and, and um, you know, supporting certain candidates and, and all of that, um, you know, what can the church do or what should the church do or what can we do uh, really to kind of go at this rightly, right? Is that basically your question? Um, I would argue that most people don't even know the five non-negotiables of Catholic voting. There's actually a great booklet called the five non-negotiables. Um, and that's what ought to be leading your voting as Americans. Um, you know, I'm a very proud American, very proud Texan, and I too am struggling with where this country is going. But I know that my vote is only as good as I, as I uh, allow myself to obey what the church tells us how to vote. And that's how they've done it, is by giving us these five non-negotiables. Um, so highly recommend a deep, thorough study of that, and that will kind of lead uh, who you vote for. I don't want to say any particular candidates because I'm not going to do that, but um, you know, I would definitely look into the five non-negotiables. That's a big one.